What's up guys, episode 6 of my survival let's play. Uh, today I will be building a few spawners because, well, I have collected a few. Uh, off camera I bought a blaze spawner and also found a skeleton spawner. As well, I also looted a, um, a ocean monument to get some wet sponge. Also have some boat keys and a bee nest. Uh, also, sadly, our friend did despawn. Uh, I was going to cure him, but well. That didn't work out. Uh, but now I'm going to, first off, go through here and mine up all the way up to this. Or I'll mine up all the way to the this wood, uh, another four blocks down. I already started a bit bit of a trench here, but I gotta go to go, go a few more blocks down so I have room to place all the spawners in and build up the chambers. So first off, I will be mining up all of this cobblestone. Let's go. All right, finish this first two layers. But all, what I'm also gonna do here is I'm gonna I'm gonna mine out this center part as well, four blocks down, just because my acrobatics level is pretty high at this point. So I do have a really good chance of rolling when I do drop, and uh, instead of taking fall damage, I don't. So yeah, I'm just gonna keep moving this down. This will also help raise my acrobatics. But yeah, uh, now to mine the next two layers right here as well. Alright, so mind all of this out, and what I'm going to actually do is I'm going to put three different spawners on this side and then put a separate spawner for blazes uh, somewhere else. But what I'm going to do here is, let me let me get these grids up here. So I'm going to put the zombie spawner here, the, skele or the cave spider one here, and the uh, skeleton one here. So I've got room for all of the spawners in all different spots. Or... What I'm tempted to do is just put a giant water stream starting like here, going all the way down, all pushing them into like two or three different tunnels, and I'll mix up all, all the mobs instead, just so like it'd just be easier to uh, uh, kill all at once. More more chambers, but when I, I've already gotten a lot of stone from mining with my silk touch pick. Now I'm gonna get a bunch of glass to, uh, I guess, make it make it more visually appealing when uh when you're in here uh probably need to get amethyst too i'm gonna go explore some caves see if i can find any uh or maybe just use normal glass and just decide not to light up everything here but i think what i will do is actually go out and find some amethyst so what i'm gonna do is i'm gonna go to home 10 see if any of those amethysts have grown i don't think any of them have but hopefully they have uh, but yeah, I've got a lot of resource gathering to do here to complete this. Okay, only the fully grown ones actually give me stuff. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to go AFK here for a bit, get a bunch of uh, amethyst shards, maybe buy them off AH. But yeah, get a bunch of amethyst shards to where I can get tinted glass for that base. Uh, but yeah, kind of resource gathering here. Uh, I've already got a bunch of stone, so I'll build the outline right now, actually. Uh, and then I can go back through and add all the glass and then add the spawners and water last. Uh, but yeah, uh, I'm going to go through some design changes real quick and then figure out what I want to actually do. So I'll be back in a second. So I'm actually deciding to make three different spawner chambers. Uh, so far, all I've got is the um, cave spider one, which so far I only have ten tinted glass. But over, I'll slowly get more and more. But what I'm going to do here now is get some water and start these water streams uh, don't believe I have any buckets so I get two buckets real quick as well as buckets I do need to make a lot of signs uh, because well I made it one too long for what it should be so 30 signs should be enough uh, also been slowly expanding the sugar cane uh, I guess wall all the way around but what I'm gonna do here is come in here and place these I'm just gonna place cobblestone for now and then slowly 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 replace it with tinted glass I say slowly because well I don't have a sufficient uh, uh, amethyst farm or anything like that don't have an amethyst geode near me but now I'm gonna place these signs here oh, didn't mean to type there um, place these all the way to the edge uh, this is a really little makeshift uh, makeshift uh, 
grinder, or I guess spawner area, but that's fine for now. Uh, might perfect it later on. The other spawners will be different, so that'll be that'll be good. Um, but yeah, uh, do need way more tinted glass than I have now. And now that I've got that placed in, now I can see what I need to do and change. Uh, so one thing I do need to do is I need to extend this by one. Place blocks, blocks. Uh, and actually, I think I might make this my uh, killing spot. So what you're going to want to do is you're going to want to place an extra block here, put hoppers if you want underneath, which I will be doing. Uh, and then I need to get some slabs, and then I also need to get a trap door. So I'm going to go wooden slabs, and then I'm going to do a stone brick. I said that backwards. Yeah, wooden trap door, and then stone brick slabs. So what you're going to do is place the slabs here, and then place the wooden trap doors on the top side of this block so these spiders cannot crawl through. Uh, actually, I think I might, well, I don't know what I'm going to do. Uh, I might change it up off camera, but this is a little grinding spot. All i got to do is stand here and start swinging, uh, but also I am going to place two more bricks right there to where I can stand right here and just swing away at these guys. Might change up this design a little bit, maybe put um, stairs here instead, and then put um, and then put the trap doors down low. But yeah, uh, so far this is what I've got, and I'll be expanding this and slowly getting more uh, getting more tinted glass and glass into this. What actually, um, hmm, I want to put the spawners in right now, so I'm gonna just um wall this all in with cobblestone for now. So I'm going to do this and then grab all the spawn. So I've gone in, placed these, uh, placed all the cobblestone, but I also changed up the design here. Uh, I put a stone fence and a wooden fence right here instead. I don't think the spot, the spiders can crawl through, but it'll make it easier for me to hit them. But what I'm going to do now is actually come in here. This might be difficult to get out of. Uh, let me mine that there as well. Uh, place this here. And then I'm gonna place in these spawners. Uh, just gonna um, I'll place them one down from the roof. Uh, just place them all in. All these guys are already spawning. Oh, get out! Get out! Come on! Get out! Get out! No! No! Stop! No! Let me out! Okay, now that I've gotten out, uh, I can see this is working. Okay, so it is. Uh, oh, very very efficient. Uh, I wish I was able to actually see inside this thing more than I actually can, but it looks like it's doing really good. Uh, I think I need to go in there and place a bunch of blocks on top of those spawners. Uh, but yeah, um, basic design works really, really well. I, I can already tell. Uh, I'll be getting a lot of XP from this, lots of spiders, and of course lots of string and spider eyes as well. Uh, yeah, I'm just going to kind of sit here, see how much I can get. Uh, I don't think I can get very much. I keep getting a little too close. I'm going to stand here instead. Uh, but yeah, what I need to do now is actually build build um, the skeleton and zombie chambers as well. So I'm going to start off and do the skeleton one. i show you all kind of what I do here. This one will be looking a lot different than that. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to go four blocks in from here. So this will be the corner. One, two, three, four, and then this will be the spot where I kill them. So I'm going to block, 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 oh, block, block. So there, and then go three out in each direction, and then fill in the center. That wasn't three blocks, that was two. Uh, <laughs> I cannot count. Uh, but yeah, fill in all of this. It's just kind of like the sky block ones I built, but this one instead is, well, survival, obviously. Uh, I think actually in a second I'm going to need to get more, uh, actually I'm yeah, doing pretty well here, uh, but yeah, uh, place this and then make sure I need to put a rim around this thing and then cage it in with glass and stone bricks. And of course on these walls I'm not going to put glass, I'm going to put just purely stone bricks. Um, yeah, I'm going to fill in these corners and then show y'all the water placement and where I'm going to put the spawner. Alright, so I have built the frame, also I've built a little uh, area. This is actually where I'm going to kill them. I'm going to make a drop shoot out of the tinted glass once I get it. Um, but what I'm going to do here is 
place in all of this cobblestone on the edges. I've also got to fill in the walls with it as well. I forgot to actually fill in this roof here, so let me do that. Also, sorry, I'm kind of all over the place. Um, yeah, um, fill this in, and then I'll show you all how perfect this design is because, well, the water actually flows perfectly towards the middle, so you don't have to put any signs or anything like that. So what I'm going to do is grab my four water buckets here, place them one in each corner. They will all try to reach... Did I build this wrong? Oh, I built it one too... What did I do? Oh, I built it one too skinny on this side. So actually, let me let me expand that real quick. <laughs> okay, now that I've actually fixed that, my bad on that. <laughs> Little stupid brain right there. Not really thinking, not testing beforehand. But yeah, now I've got this. Uh, I'm going to fill in these walls real quick with cobblestone. And then I'll be able to place my skeleton spawner in here to where I now have a skeleton grinder as well as that cave spider. Uh, but over the next few episodes and next episodes of this series, I will be filling in all of this uh, all of this cobblestone with tinted glass instead of, well, cobblestone. Uh, so what I'm going to do is go into my PV, grab my skeleton spawner. I'm going to grab the dark oak fence, actually, because I feel like that would look pretty cool. Make sure I am dead center on this thing and then place the spawner. I'm also going to place that there just so none of these guys fall down so I can actually create this drop chute I want. Uh, and then fill that in and then I'm going to make this drop chute. Uh, I think for now I'm just going to make it out of these stone bricks. Uh, let me make sure I'm in the right spot here. Stone bricks all the way down to where the skeleton can't get out and then break this right here place that and then at some point these skeletons yep will flow right in and they will give me a perfect spot to kill these guys um, uh, I'm gonna add more spawners once I get more spawners but for now this is all I have and this is what all I really need now I'm gonna go over replicate this exact spawner onto this side and make it out of zombie so finished the uh, zombie one as well uh, this one was a lot easier to build because um, I already knew exactly what I wanted to do uh, but what I'm going to do now is, uh, from mining all of this stuff up, I saved a bunch of andesite. So I'm going to actually use polished andesite as my, uh, pathway block that I'm going to use to go in between each thing. So I'm going to get here, line up with here, and I'm going to just dig out the pathway, two by two pathway all the way down. Of course, I'll add lighting to it and stuff like that because, well, this cave is very dark and I keep um, my, I guess, lights, you can say, all the way on all of the time. Uh, but yeah, I'm going to build in these pathways, and then I'll cut back once I get them all built. All right, all right. Finished up the pathways to each of the things. Uh, I think off camera, I think I might mine out most of this, if not all of it. Actually, I don't know. Might not even start it. Who knows? Uh, but off camera, I'll probably mine some more and stuff like that. But other than that, guys, uh, this is today's episode. Uh, built three spawners, so if y'all are online, feel free to TP to me and I'll let y'all use them. Zombie, um, Cave Spider, and Skeleton. Skeleton will probably be the one I use the most. Um, also need to make a enchanting table. But with all of that being done, said, and done, uh, thank you guys for watching. Please like and subscribe if you're just now seeing this. Uh, also, feel free to share it with a friend that you also might think will like this. With all that being said, thank you guys for watching. Peace out.